treat dad at home, make him a big brunch or make him a wonderful lunch or dinner, you're going to need some drinks to go along with that. And we have a ton of suggestions for you here today. We also have Mike Taylor, who is get yourself a title like this if you can in life. He is the director of, of adult, adult beverages. beverage. A lot of people probably don't believe that when nope, you tell them that don't. that is your official title. And you brought us a ton of things here from the Nugget. Now we see a lot of Cards, T-shirts, aprons, all that kind of stuff that reference dad yep. and beer. And yep. we're going to circle back to that. But let's Excellent. start with something that maybe people don't think about when it comes to dad. Maybe think mom, Mother's Day, wine. But yep. you've got some mixes for us. This one actually is the blend, and this is what? Yes, yeah, so that's a nice Cabernet Merlot blend from Bordeaux. Of course, you know, California, Cabernet is king here, but they do a great job in Bordeaux as well. Mm -hmm. So that's one of our favorites, a nice fun wine. We also love the Pinot Noirs coming out of Oregon. And that's what we have in the glass. That's what we have in the glass. Okay. Yep. And why Excellent. is this a good choice for dad, do you think? Uh, you know, because it's very food friendly. So it doesn't matter mm -hmm. if you're going to barbecue them up some burgers, some ribs, even if you're going a little fancier, that wine will pair with almost anything and he'll be happy as can be. And that's a great thing because a lot of people are kind of afraid to yep. do. Exactly. The, they, they know pairing should happen. Right. They're like, okay, but we're just grilling. Because dad so just confident, like burgers, but what can I have? Pinot's great, versatile, great choice. Whenever you're not sure, go Pinot Noir. All righty. Well, that yep. is great advice. You also have another one of my favorites. A lot of people are going to do brunch for dad, oh, which yeah. is probably going to be closer to noon or one. Well, that's probably. a great way to start. So, yeah. And what is this? Because it's not just a regular Bloody Mary. No, so that is a balsamic bacon infused vodka that we made and then made the Bloody Mary out of that. So standard Bloody Mary mix, but you really get a lot of flavor out of that infusion in the vodka. So the bacon flavor really comes through when was it was infused. Say, Give key, it a sip. See the, what you the think. The key word there, bacon. Bacon. bacon exactly. exactly. It's a great mm. way to start start Father's Day. A little Bloody Mary. Then you can work into some wine or some spirits. Mm. You definitely can taste that. And of course, you got to love with uh, Bloody Mary's all the little accoutrements of that course. come Got to get your vegetables too. Exactly. And let's just talk about what we have in front here because this is just a little drink on the rocks. Well, while you're waiting, while you're having your appetizer. That's it. So, you know, bourbon's real popular these days, makes a great gift for dad. And we've got a nice selection and that's just a little bourbon on the rocks. Real simple, real neat and great idea for pops. All righty. So many things, lots of ways. And we have, you know, the Nugget always has a huge selection of beer. Some of these from out of Oakland and around the area. Yep. So beer always is standby, but you can, you can expand a little yeah. bit, get dad a little bourbon, a little gin, a little Bloody Mary. Right. Thank you so much yeah. for coming in yeah, to share just... what we can whip up for dad, you know, treat yeah. the spirit in our household with some other spirits. So that's a great way to celebrate Father's Day. Mike Taylor, director of adult beverage from the Nugget. Well, thank you. <laughs> All righty, back to you.